What is going on guys? It is the Phantom Michael bringing you the second episode of our Pokemon Sword Nuzlocke Challenge. On the last episode, you guys, we went ahead and got our starter Pokemon Sobble that we nicknamed Agent. Agent Sobble is with us. We are going to tell our mother that we are on our way to start our Pokemon journey. We have no Pokeballs and that is it. Um, let's do a quick team recap, of course, just to show you guys. Um, all I got is Sobble. I never even checked anything. I was just so excited to play the darn game. Uh, Torrid is the ability. Um, his nature is bashful, which is, I cannot remember, I think I'm neutral nature. Yep, pretty sure. So yeah, there we go. Um, Dynamax level. Don't even know what that is. Don't know what that is yet. So, okay, cool. So let's go ahead and keep going. We're going to go tell our mother. Actually, I need to save it because I did not save it in between episodes. So here we go. All right, let's go ahead and keep going. Mother, we're leaving. Sleep in Snorlax, as always. There's my Modri. What? Well, now, isn't Sabo just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Sabo will battle to the very end for you. So don't you go pushing the poor deer too hard. And you saw, we'll look after my little phantom. Come home to rest any time that you need, after all. East or west, home is best. Alright, well, mother said it best, I'm out of here. Goodbye, Bidoofs. On the way, going down. And where are we Can I go through here now? I cannot, okay. Okay. Here we go. This is quite the big step, you know. My first step toward becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Score Bunny a bit by having it battle against Pokemon in the tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great red and white ball. Mark out in front. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. Oh wow, it's like right there, dude. So I wonder if I just run over there real quick because I don't have any. Okay, so we're gonna have to cut this way. Okay, so they do pop out overworld style, just like Let's Go. So that's cool. Rookity with under. Awesome. So I wonder how the um, shiny hunting would go. It would be interesting to find out. Alright. Got potion. No Pokeball. What is this thing, dude? A blib bug? A freaking blib bug. What is this crazy little thing, dude? Hold up, I want to get a little shot of this real quick. I have n What is this freaking thing, dude? What is this thing called? A blib bug. A blib bug. Okay. Do I have Pokemon's? Oh, I do. Oh, okay. So the lock has started. Dang. Did not know that. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll count this as the first encounter because I dang sure didn't have Pokeballs and she didn't say we had any. So this is going to be our very first Pokemon right here. Blib bug. It's going to be our first Pokemon. Oh, it broke free. Wow. I kind of figured that Route 1 would be the... Uh, Go to route for the very first Pokemon. Okay. Hopefully, I don't kill it. The pound. Perfect. Struggle bug again. Let's see what happens here, guys. Let's see what happens here. What are we gonna name this thing? Okay, cool. So that one was kind of, could have been forfeited, but I decided that, hey, I'm going to keep it just because it didn't say we got Pokeballs, it didn't say anything, it just, we just had them. So that is what we're going to do. Lip bug. I think I want to keep this thing's nickname. I don't know what to call this thing. I'm just going to, oh, dang, dude, do I even, I'm not going to nickname this thing yet. I'm just going to, it's going to be Blood bug. 
Just so we can get used to this thing, man. What is that? Is that a... Okay, that's the score of it. That's the... That is a weird little, um... Thing, but that was our Route 1 encounter. The, uh... The weird little bug. Level 6, dude. Okay. Level 6. Level 6, dude. He's got bite. Oh, man. Oh, boy. AJ, you better end this, dude. Oh, man. Does all Pokemon get... They do, dude. All Pokemon gain experience. That's cool. Blip Bug has gained one level. Cool. I'm gonna go to bag real quick. I got how much money did she get? I can't believe she gave me five Pokeballs or someone gave me five Pokeballs and didn't say anything. That is the only reason why I said I'll take Blip Bug as just a like grace because it didn't say that I got Pokeballs. Two paralyzed seems cool. Pokemon don't chase you either. Sweet. Alright, I'm gonna go heal real quick. And then we'll Keep going. Wedge hers. Let's see if I, I wonder if I can get an encounter here. Hmm. Well done. You reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. You did a fair sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with directions. See how your world has already grown, all thanks to having Pokemon with you. I know I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost in all time. Now, in we go. Dude, let's check this awesome Pokemon Center. Let's check this awesome Pokemon Center. I've got to give it to you, Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. Bowark? Oh my god, I want one. A Yamper. What is it today, Leon? Looking for info on another never-before-seen super-strong Pokemon? I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is the real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonya. What can I say about Sonya? Well, I like the way she cooks. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. Just what kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. Anyway, nice to meet you. My name's Sonya. I'm the professor's assistant. This is Phantom. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Set him on the right path, would you? Hmm. Freaking adorable. What does he think I am? He's always got his head on the in the clouds. No wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh, looks like you've got a, a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Bzz. Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation, too. That said, Leon still gets lost, too. So. Oh, sorry. So, so tell me. Do you know a lot about Pokemon? Well said. In that case, I'll make it so that you can use the Pokedex in your Rotom phone. Sweet, got a Pokedex. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my Gran. Could you let Gran know that you've received the Pokedex? She lives in the house down along Route 2. Okay, cool. So we gotta go tell Gran that we got the Pokedex. Um, whiteboard is probably covered with notes, top or bottom. I don't know what that is up there. Is there anything up here? Let's run up here. What is the Dynamax phenomenon? This phenomenon is which Pokemon take on the gigantic forms has only been discovered in the Galar region. Moreover, it only seems to occur in specific locations under set conditions. Okay, cool. On the gigantification of Pokemon, while the general principle holds that Pokemon grow stronger and larger by evolving, it is also true that simply making oneself appear larger is another survival strategy with merit. 
Okay, so it's all the same. Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Cool. All right. Well, I'm going to talk to Yamper for a minute. Cool. Hey there, Turner. Sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon Lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokedex, yeah? I love talking to trainers and giving them useful stuff. Thanks, man. It's a potion. Use it when your Pokemon's HP, their hit, hit points, gets low. HP is like a Pokemon stamina. You can even use potions during battle. Knowledge is power. It's a good idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can on your journey. Thanks, man, for telling me how I play Pokemon my entire life. Oh, whoa. Glad I did that. Ooh, got a rare candy. Don't forget to do that, trainers. There is a rare candy if you cut this way. There is a rare candy if you go that way. I'm just, I'm not gonna read every little detail that all these people say, because these are probably just your little nonsense NPCs. Wow, okay, so that's first impressive right there. By the grand building besides the Pokemon Research Lab. Nice. And nothing else. Cool. Just trying to talk to everybody and just see if we can get anything else. So I'm not going to be reading everything. Set Charizard pose. Okay, what's in here? Oh, you just sit down. Nice. Awesome. Welcome to the Pokemon Mart, man. Okay, there's a Pokemon beer here. I'm here to buy. How much money did I want? $31,000. Holy shit. Okay, but I can't buy... I cannot buy potion. Or I can't buy Pokeballs yet, so... But she gave us Pokeballs, so that means the lock did start. So there's nothing I can do about that. What is this? The train has been de delayed due to... Rail car inspection. Okay. Cool. So there's a Mart in there, which is interesting. So. What the hell is that? Get your Pokedex from Sonya? Then it's time to meet lots of different Pokemon and start building up a strong team. But battling strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way. Not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we've got Pokemon Centers. Luckier yet, they're dead easy to spot. They look like the same everywhere you go. Come on, Phantom. Bet you've never been inside one. Hmm. So that dude must have just been a little train station mart place. Yeah, because look, this has the Pokemon Mart too. What is that thing right there, dude? Do you see that Geodude looking thing up there? Oh, I can't even point to you because I'm level with me, Phantom. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? Yes. Then the future champions got you covered. First things first, you talk to the lady. Okay, see to the left on top of that machine. What is that? It looks like a Geodude, but I don't know. You talk to the lady at the top counter if you want your Pokemon healed up. And Pokemon you catch are kept in computers like the one you can find here. See, after all, you can only bring six Pokemon with you on the road in your party. The potions they sell at the Pokemon Mart got me out of a real rough spot the other day. If two kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Cheers, I'm already good, though. I'm headed route two, Phantom. Come find me maybe when you're done here. Okay, cool. So let's go explore this. What is that thing? Got some Pokemon questions. Rate, rate and nickname. Remember a move, forget a move. Okay, first place. Already got that. What is that? Hey, trainer, what can I help you with? Check boxes. Okay, Pokemon boxes. I wonder if that thing's just a robot. That's cool. okay, cool. Let's heal up real quick. Does it show our Pokemon on the screen? Yeah, it does. Dude, that's so freaking cool, dude. Oh my god, that's awesome. That is awesome. What do you guys say? Nothing? Nothing good? Alright. You have Pokeballs? No Pokeballs for sale. That's fine. I still have three Pokeballs left though, just in case. Ooh, hmm, did you want to tell me your fortune too? 
Okay, in that case, can you tell me the month you were born? Uh, I was born in 09. Next, I need to know the day you were born. 29. I got it. So your birthday is 0929. So since you were born in 0929, your fortune is... Let's see here. Hmm, what's that saying here? Oh, this must be from my snack. The page is smudged in. I can't really read it. Mm-hmm. People with your birthday are going to be super duper lucky. You want to even run into a legendary Pokemon, or maybe not. So anyway, see you later. <laughs> super. Oh, she just disappeared, period, dude. Holy shit, that was crazy. She disappeared. Wow. Um, oh, clothing store right off the bat, too, dude. And look at that. Phantom found another item. Found a Poke doll. A, a doll that attracts the attention of Pokemon. I guarantee you escape from battle. Hmm. It's fun to do some shopping to bank with. Let's check it out. Let's check out 31 grand, dude. Let's change my outfit already, dude. I'm ready to or I'm ready to change my outfit. I'm ready to change. So let's see what we got. We got uh what what are all these? These are shirts, jeans, hat. I wonder if these are everything that I have. No jackets. Do I have any? Do I have any, any, anything good right now? I wear glasses. Would you like to go with this look? Leave without changing. Yep, okay. We need to wait, progress a little bit, get some more outfits because that was pitiful. That was pitiful to pick from. Berries, I've got your fresh picked berries here. Yeah. Orange berry, cherry berry, petcha berry. You know what? I'll take two of each. I'll take two of each. There we go. And the reason why is I'm going to my bag and I am going to give to Sobble. And I'm going to give to Bill. You know what? I didn't even look. I'm just so excited about the Stukin game. I'm so excited about the Stinking game that I don't even think to look at my Pokemon. He's adamant nature. She is adamant nature. Um, she's pure bug type. She is adamant nature, of course. Struggle bug is the only move, which is fine. Okay, cool. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. Mystery gift. Get a mystery gift. We're gonna look at that later. A little bit off-screen stuff. So, that's fine. Talk to these gorgeous girls right here. Anything? Nope. Okay. Listen, Phantom, I've been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try and hand your hand at the gym challenge, right? The gym challenge, mate. The annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is that you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up to the snuff, so I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she could help. You've got to take part too. A proper rival is just the thing where every trainer needs to keep growing stronger after all. Keeps you motivated, right? The professor's house is way down at the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give our teams the chance to train up a bit along the way. Okay, cool. So we're coming over to Route 2. We'll go over here real quick first. Talk to Granddad. Nothing's your room right here. Can't go in there. Turned on the telly, I did. Turned it off. That's really cool mechanic right there. Nope, oh, come on, turn back around. Turn back around, thank you. Hmm. Alright, that's all I got there. Still no uh, full 360 rotation, though. Hmm. You must be a Pokemon teacher. Cool. Alright. 
I wonder if this is my first random trainer. See the house in the distance with the purple roof? That's where the Pokemon Professor lives. Dang, that's pretty far away, actually. Look at that water, dude. Oh my god. Look at that water. Route 2 it is. Alright. Over here, Phantom. Alright, Phantom. It's time we filled in our teams a bit. And I'm here to teach you how. You'll need to catch Pokemon if you've got any hope of filling that Pokedex. Lee, where'd you come from? Only look at you, little Phantom. Your mom gave you those Pokeballs, did she? I'll give you some more Pokeballs in return. I'll only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem easy to catch, almost like they're itching to join someone's team. What did you say? 20 freaking Pokeballs. Alright, so I gotta start writing on my freaking page right here. Um, so Route 1 was the, uh, oh my goodness, I don't even know that friend's name. He's on the layout, I don't even know his name. And of course you get DHP from battles, that Pokemon Thrive. Your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. But even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, alright? All right, I'm gonna catch loads of Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. All right, so we're on Route 2 right now. What was the name of the first Pokemon we caught? Blibbug. Blib. Bug. Okay. That was our first encounter, first Pokemon that we caught. All right, let's do it. Okay, I didn't even get a chance. Squarvit, it is. Squarvit it is. Squarvit it is. So we're gonna fight this thing and kinda get it weakened down a little bit though, because we're gonna need to. Oh, we almost killed it. Alright. I want a Pokeball. We are playing Shiny Claws, by the way. So, a shiny Pokemon will allow me to catch it, if we run into one. Sweet. Gain some experience. And we Dex Orbit. Nice. Number of battle. Dang, it even keeps coming to battle. I'm not going to nickname Scorbit just because it's a new Pokemon. Um, and me and him are going to have plenty of... Look at I like how we crouch down. That's so cool. And there's butterflies. Okay, it's not butterflies. They're running from me. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's a freaking Zigzagoon. I want one so bad, dude. Oh, I want this Zigzagoon so bad. Goodness, I want this Zigzagoon so bad. Gosh, I want this Zigzagoon so bad. Dude, I want the Zigzagoon so dang bad. That's... Dude, this looks awesome. Good job. Alright. Let's check our Pokemon really quick. He is... She is... Defensive. Cheek pouch. Restores HP as well when the Pokemon eats a berry. Okay, so I could that's cool. Tackle tail whip and bite. It's got a dark move against impish nature. Sweet dude, so it's defensive. It's a uh, normal type, right? Yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um Yeah, I'm gonna go heal. I'm gonna go heal up. Um Backtrack and heal up a little bit. They can't leave the grass though, so that's interesting. But I do like how they're overworld again. That's so cool. Um, they probably said it in the trailer, just didn't, wasn't paying attention. Um, we got our first little trainer battle coming up too. So, but I'm gonna heal my mons real quick. Because we don't want any nonsense happening early on. 
gosh. Look how freaking cool that is. Cool. All right. Let's keep going. Let's just keep going. Route two. Oh, a yamper, dude. Yamper on the freaking route, dude. Oh, is this electric type? Is yamper electric type? I don't know, dude. Is yamper electric type? Did Squawk take this thing? I think so. I think Squawk can take it. Tail Whip, look at you. Look at you. Dude, that's not good. Okay, so we got Tail Whip. He only showed Tail Whip so far. Lowered my defense is not good. I'm gonna switch back to Agent to make sure nothing crazy happens. Agent Sobble. Nuzzle. Okay, it is electric. Oh my goodness. And I got paired. Nice. Nice. Okay, so let's backtrack back to school a bit while I'm not. Okay. Goodness, dude. Yamper was the rare encounter. And he's got tackled. That would have been a perfect Pokemon out of the team, dude. Jeez. And he's fast, dude. He's so freaking fast. And he's the bulky too, dude. Let's go stab tab. I was biting, hoping for a flinch, but it ain't. Nothing's happening. And a little better, but not much. Dude, lowered me three stages with tail whip, dude. Three stages with tail whip. Almost got him. Nuzzle coming in hard. Wow, and parrot, dude. That's it. Got him. There we go. Interesting. Okay. So, I am going to. Okay, yep, there is no run. This is as fast as we go. Cool. So let's go ahead and end the episode here. I know we didn't make it to Grandma's house, but that's okay. But um, we got ourselves a party of three right now, half a team. So is what it is. So very exciting, you guys. Three Pokemon in the team. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and end it there. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, please smash the like button. Your support is always greatly appreciated. With that, I've been the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here, and I'll see you guys in the next one.